Welcome to The Stalked. The story goes, escaped from Liam's obsession, Kate seeks refuge in her gra grandpa's mansion. Strange occurrences raise questions about Liam's presence or another figure. Unraveling mysterious letters, Kate embarks on a journey, journey seeking peace. Start. Short horror game. I had to break up with Liam, and I hope he takes it well. Hmm. Okay. So, interesting, uh... I need to make some food. I'm hungry. Okay. Um, now what? I'm gonna make an organic food. <laughs> okay. Close the door. Who would be knocking on my door at this hour? I'm not gonna answer. I mean, in real life, I wouldn't know to ignore it. Who's there? Liam. Hey, honey, can I come in? You. Ugh, Liam. I told you it's over, so now you can't come in. Come on, you can't just leave me like that. I love you more than anything. It's over, Liam. Just go home. Open the door, Kate. No, I'm not opening the door. I don't love you anymore, Liam. You'll be mine again soon. That's very bad. Sounds like he walked away. Thank God. Oh, my food it's burning. A little hot to be eaten. Did you eat it straight out of the pan? Ate food straight after I used to be kind of psycho. A bath to calm myself down a bit would be great. That's a. Oh, that's the TV. Oh, I thought this was the TV for a second. What is this? Oh, it's the balcony. <laughs> I didn't see uh didn't see the sky, I thought it was a room. Let's close that. Okay, what am I doing? Bath? Where's the bath? Um What am I missing? Where's the bath? Kitchen Another balcony? What? I guess we're on the top of a an apartment or something. Oh. Okay. This is big. Close the door. So many doors. What? He just break in. Give me another chance, please. I will treat you well and do anything you want. I promise. Just one chance is all I ask. That can't be too much. You broke my window, dude. Door. Whatever. No, no, no. I gotta leave before he does something worse. Uh-oh. You were never leaving me again. You got caught. Try again. <laughs> um. Okay. <clears throat> Did I make it out? Am I driving? Nine thirty three. Why are we just sitting here? Are we driving? Are we talking and driving? 
Hello, Grandpa, I need your help. Hey, what's going on? Liam broke into my apartment and chased me. I barely got away, and now I'm in my car with nowhere to go. That's horrible. Are you okay? Did he hurt you or something? No, I got away before he can do something, but I'm terrified he will find me. Okay, I assume you're looking for a place to stay for a while. Yes. You can come live with me for as long as you need. However, I'm going to be out on a business trip for one week. That's fine. I'm still going to be safer than staying here. Can I go there now? Yes, I'll send you the address. The key to my house is in a flower pot. Also, remember to keep the doors locked, and if you need to go outside, you can always check the people first. Durr. Okay, thanks again, Grandpa. Your lifesaver. No problem. I hope all goes well. And don't hesitate to call me again. Um. <laughs> Why have we just been sitting here the whole time? Escape Liam for now. That was a close call. Thank God I made it out. Well, why did you just sit there in your car when he was literally chasing you? Liam won't be able to find me now. I've finally broken free from that toxic relationship. Now he's got a free house. Paranoid now. Of course, it's not him. Probably just a neighbor. No, it's good. definitely gonna be him. Wouldn't be a game if it wasn't him. Press F to turn on your flashlight. Send cubes in a flower pot. Is that a flower pot? Is that a flower pot? Oh! Wow, it's dark in here. Let's turn on some lights and find the bedroom. I want to hit the bed, eh? ASAP. It's not locked. Used to be pulled for the first time. It's so dark though. I'm just turning all the lights on. Another door. Um, in here. Bathroom. Turn that on too. Turn all the lights on. I'm not paying electric bill. What? It's a bedroom. Is it the bedroom? Three fifty five. Wow, I slept that long. Wait, is this afternoon or morning? I guess it's afternoon. 
Grandpa home already? Uh oh. Where's Grandpa? He would have the key. Um, check the doors and open it. Why would you want me to open the door? Nobody there. Here's new resident of the mansion. I'm the previous owner of this mansion, and you are the person I've been looking for. I hope to see you stick around for a while. I'm sure we will get along just fine. I will be watching you. What? Watch me. This is strange to say the least. I need to get going to the store before it's dark, though. Let's be careful. What store? Go to the store. convenience store. What's that? Some kind of paper? Huh? What paper? What are you talking about? You talking about this? Missing person? Wow, it's creepy how similar she looks to me. What? RMB to switch side. Actually, missing since... 15 8 2013 please help us bring Ashley home if you have any information even the smallest detail contact please your assistance could make all the difference this is horrible I hope they found her press tab to look at the shopping list canned foods snacks soda milk cereal wine who are you Ranger oh hi there I haven't seen you before are you new yeah I just moved in where do you live I'm not telling you. I don't feel comfortable telling you that. Are you alone? Um, I'm gonna hurry. Sorry, I gotta go. Wait, are you the same person? You look like the same person. Canned food. What kind of canned food? What is that? Um, soda. What? What kind of soda do they want me to buy? This soda? Oh my god. Do I need to put it away to grab it? Oh my god. What is this? Do I need, do I need to get a shopping? Oh, that's probably it. Or maybe not. What? Oh. Chips. Can I... What? That's all. Let's go pay for this. Well, I guess we shoved it in our pocket. What if we don't pay? Wait, that's my car? It's not gonna let me. Not gonna let me shoplift? Wow, how rude. Again, 
weird doors. Is that how grocery store doors open? Hello, is that all? Uh, yeah. Alright, total 2250. Thanks for shopping, no problem. Not sure yet, not too, what? Not too long, what? What are you talking about? What did I miss? You know, a young beautiful lady like you shouldn't be out all alone like this. What do you want? I do have some wishes, but I think it's best to remain unspoken. Be careful, don't let me catch you all alone again. I don't need your warnings, respect my space and stay away. Oh my god, what's wrong with the people in this game? And do people really do this stuff? weird let's not forget the groceries in the car Okay, now what? Oh. Power went out. <clears throat> Welcome home. Why do I click on it? Can I click on it? You look beautiful in the store today. Can't wait to see you again. How'd you get to my number? <clears throat> Getting closer. See inside or out? I'm soon there. Um. Or what if I'm already there? What? <laughs> Did I see someone out there? I'm here. Check the door. Why would I check the door? anything you want me to open the door are you serious what kind of stupid thing is this okay Congratulations on setting in, settling in. You may believe this mansion is your refuge, but every step you take reveals a deeper game. I'm with you in every choice, every move. There's no escape from becoming mine. Drive away. Uh oh. Go the car. Get inside and call the cops, like right now. We just left the door open, too. Did that like a while ago. What's your emergency? I need help. I've been receiving threatening messages, letters, texts, and I'm really scared. Here to help you, can you please provide your location? I'm at. Urgent. I understand. Dispatching officers to your location right away. Can you describe the nature of the threats? They've been watching me. Follow me. Messages are getting more tense. Please hurry. Stay on the line. Help is on the way. Meantime, try to find a safe and secure location within your home. Make sure to lock your doors. Officers should be there soon. 
Yes, they're locked. Please hurry. Help us on the way. Stay strong. I'm here with you till officers arrive. Someone just tried to open the door, and we're standing right there. Officers will be there any second. <laughs> it appears everything is under control now. Officers apprehended a man in a white van outside your residence. We're bringing him in for questioning. If something else happens, don't hesitate to call us. Take care. Thank you for your help. I'll be sure to reach out if something else happens. Really? That uh, seems strange. What a relief. Never thought I'd feel safe again, but maybe things go back to normal now. Should be safe now. Let's head to the basement outside. The basement outside? Restore the power? What kind of... What kind of weird house is this? These horror games always got some weird houses. Electrical panel. Um... Why is it open? I want to be back on now. Let's take a sweat. Let's take a bath before I go to sleep. Finally, a moment of peace. Why would that stranger go so far from me? Whatever, it's over now. Hmm? So exhausted, I'm hearing, hearing things now. Let's go to bed. Noise. Sounds like coming from the storage room. This is what you should be calling the police again. What room?
It was just a nightmare. Oh. <laughs> Okay, so we're fine. I should probably call to check how Liam is doing. Why? Why? And the reason all this is happening to begin with is because I broke up with him. It's all my fault. If I had just stayed with Liam, he would have kept me safe. What? No. No, of course not. What am I thinking? Let's put my mind on something else. First, let's make sure the house is empty. I don't feel safe. The house. Upstairs looks fine. Bathroom is fine. That's outside. Um, nothing here. Something looks off about that book. Oh, hidden room. <clears throat> okay. Now what? Huh? What do you want me to do now? It says it's locked. I'm supposed to find a key? A key laying around here? Oh. Uh, 27 year old Ashley was reported missing August 15th by her husband two days after. Her, after she disappeared from the home last seen in the residence, Ashley's sudden absence has raised suspicions with her husband emerging as, emerging as a prime person of interest in the ongoing investigation. <clears throat> While authorities continue to search for leads, they urge anyone with information to come forward and assist the search for Ashley. Why wouldn't you want to leave me? I have done nothing but be good to you, whatever, doesn't matter anymore. You were never leaving me again. 7, 18, 2013. What? Look, honey, you made the news. Pretty cool, right? Oh, there's more stuff here. I can't replace you, Ashley. There's no one that is as special as you. Why did you force me to do this? I never wanted to harm you. My fault? How is it my fault? How is it my fault? I didn't want it to end like this. You left me with no other options. What the fuck do I, uh, did I do? How am I going to live on without you? What's the point of all this? I'm typing to a dead person. I would do anything to get you back. Am I dreaming? I swear that is you. She looks just like you. Have you come back to me 10 years later? She is just as beautiful as you were. She has to become mine. She will, no matter what. I can't let her run away from me like he once did. It's probably time I go talk to Grandpa. What's going on here? This is crazy. Are you really Grandpa? Grandpa, you there? Yes, has something happened? A lot has been happening. I received... Creepy letters and been following by someone I don't think is Liam. I called the police and they arrested a suspicious individual lurking around the house. But when I thought it was all over, I found a strange hidden room in your house. It contains some psychotic things, to say the least. What? This is insane. Maybe the police arrested the guy leaving the letters in a hidden room? I lived there for 10 years and never seen that. I'll be cutting this business trip short and coming home ASAP. I can't stand not being able to help you. I'd like to think they arrested him, but what if they didn't? What if he's still out there? What if they arrested someone who got set up? It makes me so easy, uneasy just thinking about it. What do you remember about the person who brought, who bought this place from? The person you bought this place from? I can't talk today. Uh, that could definitely be the case. I remember that his wife had recently gone missing without a trace. It was the talk of the town for quite a while. 
and his name was Are you serious? My phone ran on battery and I didn't have to time to bring my charger with me. Really? Let's go find a flashlight in case I need one later. I think I remember seeing one in the basement. That's why I keep a charger in my car. Find flashlight. Probably in here? Oh, it's just... oh, do I have to go in the basement? Of course. Oh! The frick? I search for a weapon just in case. Let's start by looking through Grandpa's office upstairs. Now it opens up. What? Chips? Nothing of use in here. Has to be Grandpa, right? Check the door? No. So dumb. Hey, sorry if I scared you. I just had to come clean about something. Of course you did. You, uh, you are the creep that talked to me earlier outside the convenience store. What do you want to come clean about? I know it was creepy, but it wasn't my idea. Liam told me to do it in hopes that you would take him back to feel safe again. I was supposed to take it a step further now, but I couldn't do it. I feel too sorry for you. It all makes a lot of sense now. Thank you for telling me. I still don't feel safe around you. Can you leave now, please? Yes, of course, I'm sorry again. Why do lights keep... Was on. What a bed. What about this thing? Why is it so dark in this house? Did that come from the bedroom door? Am I supposed to do that? Oh my god. You thought this was over, you feel hopeless, helpless now, don't you? Your car doesn't work, your phone is dead, the police think they got the person behind this, and you don't know where I am. There's nothing that can stop me anymore. What do I do? I know if I follow down the other path I saw when I first got here, maybe I can find some neighbors who can help me. Follow other path? What other path?
What other path? Definitely Liam's car. I don't see a freaking path. I'm going down here, but I don't know where else to go. Blood. That's Liam. What happened to you? Why would someone do this to you? She is mine. And only mine. Press shift to sprint. Must be the house. I'm supposed to leave now? Let's get in this car. We got his keys. Where am I going? Where am I going? Hello, game. Tell me what to do. I don't know what you want. You go back to his body. Maybe there's something. Okay, I get it. No, no car keys on you? What the frick you want me to do? Oh, I guess I was supposed to find this first. I think these are Ashley's remains. What a sick and twisted individual her husband is. I don't even know what he would do to me. I clicked on it before. Okay, you gonna tell me what to do now? I can't. Oh. Hey, I couldn't wait anymore. I need you now, my new Ashley. So as you has been sending letters, I know I look similar to your ex-wife, but that doesn't mean I can replace her. I don't care how you look is more than enough. Come here. I've been waiting so long for this. No, no. I have to run before it's too late. What do you think 
going? Fine. Where, where, where am I supposed to go? Oh. God, I can't even see where I'm going. Here we go. Oh, I survived. Okay. It's it's hard to see where you're going. The wall, the ceiling, the floor, everything just looks the same. Police arrived on the scene just in time, thanks to Grandpa. He hurried back home after the abrupt ending that Kate's phone call with him. When he arrived home, he realized that Kate was nowhere to be seen. He got a sinking gut feeling that the worst might have happened. He called the police instantly, and they made it just in time. The relief Grandpa felt after the news was like nothing else. What happened to everyone else involved? The man in the white van said that his reasoning for being outside Kate's home was because he saw a stranger following her home from the store. Of course, the police didn't believe him when they saw no one else was there. But when the news broke free about this, the police realized their mistake and that he had actually been telling the truth. He was released the same day. Liam's accomplice was never seen again after the incident. The psychopath who killed his ex-wife, Ashley, Liam, and almost Kate ended up getting sentenced to life in prison. Kate is doing her best to recover from the incident, but it's difficult. At night, she often hears those daunting knocks on her bedroom door, disrupting her attempts to sleep. Throughout every day, she finds herself checking behind and scanning every corner consumed by fear and paranoia. Hey, you gotta do something about that cave. It's, it's hard to see where the frick you're going. Maybe have him come in a different spot i don't i don't know that's the stalked thanks for watching my